Hi guys, it's Wendy. So today is the uh, day after my birthday, which is the 8th of September. And today is the first day of the 21 days of beauty steals at Ulta. I've actually personally never shopped at any of the 21 days because I either always miss the product that I want because of scheduling or whatever. So today they're having a sale on Urban Decay, the Stardust lip gloss for $9 only. So I'm going to go ahead and see hopefully they have any left. And um, I'm not sure if I can take the videotape into or the video camera into the store. So I'm just gonna vlog in my car and then I'll show you what I get after. See you in a little bit. Hi guys, so I'm back from my Ulta trip. I tried to um, just do like a quick haul in the car and then it just got really hot, I couldn't take it. So I turned off the camera and I drove home and I thought I'd be more comfortable being in my own apartment and things like that instead of being the smoldering heat. So um, I walked in wanting to get the Stardust lip gloss. Um, that they are having on sale today for the very first day of the Ulta 21 Days of Beauty, which is this right here. You can go on the Ulta website just to find out more about it. So today is the first day, and like I said earlier, I've actually never got to shop during one of the 21 days, even if I was there because they just didn't have what I was interested on sale. So I never really got anything. I never actually really shopped at one of those. Uh, you have no idea how insane the store was. It was just so full of people, you would think. Like, I don't know, it, it was just, <laughs> it was really, really crazy. So I walked in and I went to the uh, the uh, Urban Decay section and I didn't see any of the Stardust. I'm thinking, oh, it's too late. And one of the associates was like, no, it's over here on the table. And the reason that they're going on sale for $9 is because they're actually, um, Urban Decay is actually discontinuing and discontinuing the Stardust uh, lip gloss and uh, one of the associates actually told me that that's why they're going on sale for nine dollars so if you have, have an Ulta near you and you like one of the colors go ahead and get it so without further ado let's get started with what's inside by the way so I went in with just wanting to get one to two things I wanted to get two lip products and I left with a really big bag of course right okay so we'll get started with what I actually went in there for which is the Urban Decay Stardust Sparkling Lip Gloss and I got it, in, got it in the shade Andromeda. And it's this really pretty iridescent. My friend actually bought this a while ago, like sometime last year. She really liked it. And, I was, and at the time it was like $19, $20. And I was like, I can't spend $20 on a lip gloss. Are you kidding me? Because I have a lot of lip gloss. But this is the color. Oh, I think it's so pretty. It is gorgeous. Now, swatch some of my hand for you. And it comes with like a little brush which I never noticed before, like that, so you can kind of easily apply. I don't know if the camera will pick this up, but it's, no, of course not. It's really pretty and iridescent, and I think it'll look great over any um, lip color. So speaking of lips, you all know that Urban Decay came out with their brand new um, Revolution lipstick, and I have a lot of lip products already, and I have you know, various colors, and I always say I don't need another one, but everybody's saying such good things about it, I decided, and I worked, you know, I had a, a long day of work yesterday, I worked on my birthday, so I thought, well, I'm going to go ahead and treat myself, my birthday was yesterday, so I'm going to go ahead and treat myself to some goodies, so I got it in the shade Naked, because this is the one that everybody was kind of going crazy over, and like I said, you know, how many red lipsticks can a girl own, so I decided to not, and this, the packaging is very sleek and pretty, it looks like that. It's got Urban Decay on it, and it's in the shade Naked. So the box, actually, this caught my eye. Creamy, badass luxury. <laughs> Our pigment-infused system delivers insane color payoff with creamy shine, maxi color plumps, and nourishing oils leave lips cushiony soft. So I am actually really excited about this one. And also this packaging is recycled, if anyone um, cares to know about that. So. This is going to be more of like a, like a My Lips But Better probably color. But this is what I would wear the most. So that's why I got this one. I don't know, I'll just apply it on camera because I don't have a mirror with me. So I'll just apply it real quick. I didn't mess anything up. So it is very neutral and it is kind of like that my lips is better and I'll swatch this on my hand so you can see. I really think the color is just so pretty. 
I'll have to play with it a little bit more. And now what I want to do is since I went in and bought this awesome Stardust lip gloss, I'm going to go ahead and apply some of this right over it. I wonder if the consistency is going to be a little sticky. I don't like super sticky lip glosses, but the color is gorgeous. I kind of like it. Um, and I thought what I would do is maybe compare the Naked with some of the other like nudie colors that I have. So I have with me um, the, this is Rimmel, I don't even know. Yes, this is the Rimmel London Airy Fairy. So I'm gonna swatch right next to it, right here. You can see that's pretty freaking similar. Wow, look at that. So just to give you guys some perspective, $22, probably somewhere between $6.99 to $8.99. $22, But I do have to say, this feels really, really good going on. It's very velvety. Okay, and then I also have, this one's from e.l.f. Um, this color is Classy. And I'll swatch it on the other side. That's close too. This one's a little bit more pinky purple-y though. So, all right, moving on to my next haul. I also, where did my bag go? <laughs> I also got a fun little primer. It's a good gift when, if you bought Urban Decay today, because I guess that's what the 21 Days of Beauty gets some goodies. It's just another eye primer. This one is actually the anti aging. I wasn't aware that I even had this one. And it's just, oh, I can't get it out of the package. Look how cute! It's like a mini version of the full size. Adorable. Yeah, it's anti-aging, so I'll give this a try. I This is my favorite uh, primer, so this would be great for like traveling and stuff because it's so little. Okay, next I got another lip product, and I really, really, really want it. I'm in love with Lip Butter from by Revlon, and these are all the ones I have. Uh, also, I have peach parfait which is not here because it's in my purse and so I got the juicy papaya the last time I was there that was like months ago so I finally found it and I've been wanting to get my hands on the wild watermelon I finally found it today and here it is so I'm gonna oh my god <laughs> dropping things like I always do every video I make I drop something so I'm gonna go ahead and swatch this and look at that color it's not pretty and I love that it's like very sheer so I'll swatch it on my other hand right here oh that's pretty look at that that's gorgeous can't can't wait to play with these all right and it's so sad it's been so hot in LA that I most of my lipstick have been kind of living in the fridge because I don't they'll melt by the time I come back to the apartment I'm not gonna leave the AC on when I'm not home okay so I really really am happy with my lip purchases then I went ahead and got I needed some new brushes so I got uh, the equal tool retracting foundation brush and I thought I'd actually use it um, more as a uh, contouring brush instead so and it retracts like that so I like equal tool all of their stuff is pretty cool this is really good for getting in here things like that all right so that's what I got and there's a little cover for it that I can't get out so I'll do that after the video and then I went ahead and bought one of the Rio Technique brushes. This was actually on sale. Um, I think for like $5 or something like that. Maybe it wasn't on sale. I'm not sure. Um, I have to look at my receipt. But this is the shading brush. And I've just been hearing really, really good things about this brand and her all of her brushes. So I thought I went ahead, I go ahead and buy it. So I'll give you a review on that later. And last but not least, I went and bought my favorite brand of body wash by Vitabath. And I usually get the uh, Spa Day collection, the, what is it, like white tea and cucumber, and that's my favorite, but I, I've gone through like three bottles of those already, so I thought, well, why not give myself something different? So this time I got In Bloom Peach Blossom, no, Beach Blossom with Passion Flower Extract. And it smells to me, it actually, 
a hint of gardenia and that's what kind of made me want to buy it. I don't even think gardenia is in here, but that's what this one reminds me of. So that's it you guys, that is my haul. Um, so much for going in to get one to two things and I come out with like six. But that's what happens when you don't go shopping a lot. Alright, thanks you guys for watching and check back for more videos later. Talk to you soon. Bye.